Hi, I'm Alex Soto from Dominican Republic, professional kiteboarder. My goal is to participate in the Olympic Games Paris 2024 and win the medal goal. I'm from a small town uh, in the north coast called Cabarete. Before it was a fishing town. Now it's one of the 10 kiteboarding spots in the world. Um, that's uh, it's because we have good weather. Yeah. I've been doing freestyle for a while and I have really good results. Including top 10 of the world, six time Dominican Times Championship. A year ago, I switched to harder foil and I already started to get some good results. Dominican Championship, uh, top five in Brazil, including I call it for the country. For going to Paris, I need to do first the Pan American. For go to the Pan American, I have to do six uh, events, three international events and three national ones. The Pan American will be in August uh, 2019, so uh, this year. For the Olympic Games, we use some special equipment like the kites that are like paragliding. They don't have any tubes, they are like inflated by the, by the wind and they are very high aspect and very light. That give you better possibility to get more speed and better angles in the, in the event. Um, that's what we're looking for uh, about the board. We're using all carbon fiber board with carbon fiber mass that keep the, the stability when you get high speed and help you to perform. Um, we're training twice a day, well, me and the Dominican team and some international riders. Um, we, we do two hours in the morning and two hours in the evening. We try to perform all the skills that we've already had, including turns and maneuvers that help you to reach the finish line uh, faster we can. My speed record is 71 kilometers per hour, and the world record, uh, speed record in foil, is 81 kilometers per hour. Um, the guy who who have the record, it's Nico Parle, um, which is actually my idol. Uh, it, can be, it can become a dream if I can beat him uh, in some cool race. <laughs> I have a trick that is not part of the competition, but I love to do. It's it's an old trick uh, we call board off. It means that you have to do a big jump and take off your board out of your feet, and then put it back and prepare for the land. My best souvenir in foil was when I won my first competition last year and uh, I was competing against all the Dominican riders, the Dominican team, including some international ones. I finished up first, even when I didn't have the right equipment, I was very happy about it. And then the second thing was when I hit a shark. When I hit a shark, I didn't know that I actually hit a shark, I was not sure. But I had my GoPro and then I went out and, and I told everyone that I hit something, but I was not sure. And then when I saw in the was a clear shark that I hit it. 
I was too fast to avoid the impact. I think I I have a good opportunity to win because I'm very dedicated on, on my training and I really focusing on what I have to perform and what I have to do. And I'm very precisely about like which uh, angle I have to get and how overall or how fast or take advantage from others. And I will try to do my best. Mm -hmm.